<laughs> we are back in our VR elevator, and our ultimate goal is to summon Ultra Trainator. Whoa! And I think that's him. You guys ready to see him? Here we go! Join the project by subscribing to the channel and enable all notifications by clicking the bell. What's up, guys? Today, we are gonna find Ultra Train Eater right here in our VR elevator. In order to do that, we need to find all the parts of this awesome train and complete building it because Ultra Train Eater likes to eat big trains. So that is how we're gonna find him. Guys, leave a like on the video right here, right now. Oh, yes. And stick around till the very end to see if we can find him. Now, as you guys may or may not know, we actually found regular train eater, and that was super scary, wasn't it, Planty? Yes, it was. But ultra train eater is supposed to be gold and even bigger and more powerful, so let's see if we can find him. First, we need to find all those parts, and I think check the jackhammer over here. Oh, it's gonna help us out. I was gonna say, Jack, dude, what are these things, man? Wait, are those eyes? <gasps> Think, guys, Train Eater has got all those weird eyes on the side of his body. Oh my goodness, and, and they kind of look like these as well. Now, guys, you know me. We gotta quickly check this out. We gotta see what these eyes are all about. Oh my. <laughs> I feel like they are staring directly into my soul. Except for those two over there. Those just look kind of silly. Hello, it's -a me, James. Uh, how are you doing today? Can I put that? Ew, 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 ew. Oh, it's like wet. Oh, what in the world? How is that? Ew. Okay, well, that's just weird, man. That is just weird. I regret doing that. Let's get out of here. Actually, guys, that was kind of funny. <laughs> now, let's see. Where's the button set? All right, check the check camera. I don't know what happened in here. And clearly, you don't know either because you were asleep. But we are going to figure this out, guys. We, we have to get to the bottom of this. <laughs> oh, man, that was kind of scary already. Hey, Snowy. Dude, you didn't see, like, any train-related things, right? If you see anything train-related, let me know. It could be something to do with train eater. So now, we've got the key. We've got the shovel. That means we can go down and talk to our buddy Scotty, right? But this is the place where it's always... Ah, ah, kind of creepy, I was gonna say. Oh, 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 I see something over there. And it's not supposed to be here. Ah, ah, whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm not going there by myself, though. I, I don't want to get out of my beautiful safe elevator to go investigate something scary out there. Scully, you got to come with me, my friend. We got to check that out. It looks like some kind of an old train. Oh, oh no. <gasps> Whoa. It is an old locomotive train. Dude, Scully, do you know anything about this, man? It's the bait for train leader. Oh, what do you mean, bait? Oh, but this thing is too small, man. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Some evil dudes are at a graveyard trying to get Train Eater in here. That's what we are trying to do. Yo, we gotta beat him. We gotta get out of here super fast and find those other train parts. We can make a train that is way bigger to get Ultra Train Eater in here, right? So let's go to the volcano for the next step. Wait, is there gonna be anything trainy here? <gasps> yes! Because there's a train part in the lava. Oh, I can't get to it, though. Hey, uh, Scully, uh, can you get to it? I mean, you don't have any flesh, you know. Yoink, there you go. It's not like he can burn, right? Whoa. Okay, he comes right back. I'm sorry, Scully. Don't be mad at me, please. <laughs> All right. We're going to take this burning piece of beautifulness all the way up to, uh, wow, Snowy the Snowman. Because, uh, Snowy, I asked you, man, did you see anything train related? And you just ignored me. That is rude. And now I need my revenge. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, guys. <gasps> Wait a minute. Okay, so we get the hat. That is good. But that is not what I expected. Oh, it's a piece of the train. I knew it. I cannot trust Snowy the Snowman any longer. He was hiding this all the time. So let's see if we can attach this to the train. Um, how do we do that, though? Whoa. There it is! Oh, beautiful! Okay, so now we just need some parts at the front and maybe something at the back to complete this train. Whoa, and we get some new floors as well. Ooh, oh, this is going super well, guys. All right, we're gonna go back to Planty. Oh, what if he is also hiding a train part? Oh, yes, Mr. Planty looking for some water, you say? Well, I can get you some water if you can get me just a little train part. How does that sound? Come on, man. I need train parts, please. 
Okay, that is not exactly. Oh, oh. Wait, what? What? Okay, that made no sense. We were at floor two where we could see a train that was making noise. This time I don't see anything. Okay, that is weird. Planty, you, you, you just stay right there. <gasps> Wait, it's open at the ceiling. What if it came from above? All right, we gotta get out of here. We gotta go up. We're at floor four. We're gonna go all the way up to floor nine because here there should be. Hello? Huh? Wait, there's no train here. Piggy, did you see any, any trains, huh? Uh, tell me, come on, man, get up. All right, there he goes. <laughs> All nice and happy. Did you see a train? There's no way. There is no way, my friend. All right, um, nom, 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 nom. Give me that beautiful coin. Thank you, sir. Watch out for any trains, okay? This is like the city, and trains like to be in cities, you know? So please, do not get eaten alive, okay? I mean, he is basically one big ball of walking bacon. <laughs> You throw that guy on the barbecue, he's gonna be tasty. Oh, I do not want to think about that. Because Piggy Pig is my friend, of course. I do not want to roast my friends. I think. So now, we have shrunk the coin. Which means we can use it on Gumball Guy. Let's see if there's like a super happy train. Uh, right over here. In floor 7. I don't think so, right? <gasps> but I do see something over there. What is Mr. B doing? Hold on, he's got something. That is something different. Oh, and it looks like a port. Guys, that actually looks like a train port. So we know this one on floor three. But now we also know this one right over there. At least, no, it's maybe a strong word. We still gotta figure it out. But that's gonna happen. Just like this accident. <laughs> All right, Mr. B, mark my words. I will be back for my train part, you hear me? So, now, let's see if we can go bowling. <gasps> oh, because at the bowling alley... Wait, no, wait, hold on. Bowling alleys have nothing to do with trains, right? I, I, that was a little bit weird. I think I had a little bit of a brain fart. Oh, wee. And it's a smelly one. <laughs> All right, so we got the bowling ball. Let's go to floor eight and see if... Uh, oh, right. Maybe the train noise we heard earlier is here. Hello? Did it come from over here? Yeah, I don't think... Uh, uh. What? I heard a whistle. Okay, something is going on, people. Oh, and look at the counter over here. Wait, that's a whistle. Oh. <gasps> It's a whistle from one of those train dudes. I don't know what they are called, okay? But the, but the train people, they, they carry this. So when the train is about to leave, they're gonna go like uh, with the whistle, you know? Come on. Yo. Yeah, like that. Okay, I'm not so good at that. We're just gonna put that over there because maybe... Wait, maybe we can use this to get the train to actually move, you know? Because anytime, like a hunter wants to seek out a prey... They look for things that move. And you know that because every time something moves, you're like, hey, what's going on over there? So we got to build a train and then use this to make it move. All right. I like this plan, people. I like this plan. We're going to get train eater in here. <laughs> and we're going to live, okay? We are not going to... We are not going to die, my friend. Unlike Gumball guy. Oh, no. From 4-7. <laughs> that guy is done for. By the way... I completely forgot to throw Scully out here. You have had quite the adventure, my friend. I like it. Now get out of this creepy place. Get away from the eyes. Come on. There you go. We're going to follow them. We're going to follow them super fast. Come on. Go down super fast, elevator. Whoa, whoa. whoa, whoa. Oh, that was fast. All right. Oh, back at the train. And back at Gumball. Guys, see, that's what I mean. He didn't make it. He didn't make it at all. But thank you for your very last Gumball. It surely is an honor to receive it. <laughs> we will avenge you, my friend. It will all be okay. So let's go back to Piggy the Pig because we're still going to figure out where that train noise came from. I don't think it came from this one, right? All right oh. See, I knew it. It came from over here. Oh, Piggy, you gotta be so super careful, my friend. Wherever there's a train sound, there could be a train. And if there's a train, there could be a train eater. Watch out, my friend. <laughs> oh, poor Piggy. He has no idea what train eater looks like. Let alone ultra train eater. That is gonna be spooky to the maximum. Wait, guys, before we get out of here, we gotta check this out. This is typical train eater era you know don't really see anything trainy though wait a minute there was a train sound coming from the back hello oh that's where the doors are let's go outside right okay we have never actually been here this is really creepy actually <laughs> all right we're there oh there it is again okay we're not gonna go in there that is totally terrifying i think we're gonna go back and uh see what we can do with the shrinking and the growing of course that's why we're here wait and if i stand here and the elevator goes up or down 
Am I gonna shrink or grow? Okay, you know what? We gotta get out of here, man. I am determined to somehow take him down, right? And it's not gonna happen with this thing. We gotta find something to defend ourselves, maybe. So now, we've got the gum. Remember, we are on a mission for Mr. B. Oh, but we can't go to the basement yet. We are still yet to go to floor 10, of course. All right, Mr. Mustache. Oh, whoa. Dude, what is that? Wait, is that a... Is that a train wheel? Mr. Mustachio, you think you are so funny. I was laughing at me with your mustachio. What in the world you got going on over here, man? So the other train parts to be collected were like really small. And they certainly weren't moving like this. How do we pick this thing up? I, I don't think we can take this with us, right? Well, we are surely gonna try. So I got my beautiful little hand over here. Pew, 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 pew. See, I, 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 can't, I can't grab that. That's so weird. We gotta figure out how that works. We gotta get out of here back to the elevator and uh, go to the basement. That's right, Mr. Mustachio with your shiny behind. <laughs> We're gonna need that button right over there. And for that, I've got this device. Thank you, sir. Guess you know he's made out of metal. <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't think Train Eater is made out of metal, right? Although he should have a lot of metal inside of him. Now, let's tickle him and go all the way down to the basement floor. This is how we're gonna get the next train part. I just know it, okay? And there we go. Hey, fishies, it's me, James. Now, these guys don't have to worry about Train Eater because I really don't think that Train Eater or Ultra Train Eater would actually swim on the water. That, that doesn't happen, right? I don't think that does. All right, Plenty, you gotta help me out, my friend, you hear me? You gotta grow nice and big, nice and strong, so we can trick Mr. B and get that next train part. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> grow, grow nice and big, come on now. And there's all these eyes over here. <laughs> They're probably looking at us like, huh, what's cooking over here, huh, a big Plenty? Yes, a big Plenty. And we're gonna put the big gum on the big plant and then we're gonna get the big B in the big trap. How does that sound? <laughs> oh, 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 and how does that sound? More creepy train sounds. <gasps> Ooh, but that looks really good. So is that the front or the back of the train? I think that's the front, right? Hey, thank you, Mr. B. You know what? I'm not even gonna ask how you got this. I'm just gonna be very happy that we got this part. Wait, there's a light at the front. Just like we saw on floor two. So this has to be a front piece. Uh, amazing. We're gonna put it on there. See if that works. Come on. Ah, yes, it's on there. Awesome. All right. So now we need just one more part to complete the train. <laughs> and we are gonna find Ultra Train Eater. All right. Let's get that meat, ladies and gentlemen. The barbecue is about to begin. <laughs> this is gonna be one of those weird... Underwater barbecues. I don't know how that works, okay? You can ask SpongeBob about making fire on the water. Not me. I just I just go fishing. That's why. <laughs> Greetings once more, all my fish friends. Uh, I have returned very nobly to offer you this beautiful gift. There you go. <laughs> I just got a little meat for my fish friends. So where's the fish at? Oh, it's right over here. Hey, buddy. Yo, give me that train part. A police. I need it, okay? I need it. It's the last part of our beautiful creation. Ooh, and I know it's gonna look beautiful, right? So this is like a guard that they put at the front so that anything that's on the railroad is just gonna get knocked off, you know? But I don't think this is gonna work <laughs> for Ultra Train Eater because he's like super massive, you know? He's so big, he's just gonna eat the whole thing. Ultra Train Eater is surely gonna love this one. Let's see, can we put it... Can we put it at the front? I think we can, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Put it on like this. There we go. All right. Is it on there? I think it is, right? <gasps> and there goes the train. No way. That's awesome. Ah! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that was the monster. That was him. What? <laughs> whoa, whoa, wait, what just happened? What just happened? <gasps> the whistle. It's gone. I guess that's what caused the train to move, right? Oh, people, that's him. That's him. So now all we got to do is take this elevator and launch it to wherever Ultra Train Eater is. Wait, where are we going? Where are we going? Is this gonna stop over here? Are we gonna go on the railroad? Not really, right? Oh, so it's gonna open. Oh, 
And it's gonna close off. All right, all right. This looks good. This looks really good. And now we should have, oh, a beautiful button. So we're gonna launch this thing to Ultra Train Eater Universe or Planet or wherever we're gonna go. And we're gonna find this monster. You guys ready? Here we go. Oh, oh my. Oh, that was bright. Wait a minute. Where in the world are we now? <laughs> oh my goodness, that's him! That's him! Holy guacamole, guys! Wow! It's Ultra Train Eater! <laughs> Incredible, guys! And if you want to see more of this dude, go check out my second channel link in the description below. Thank you guys for watching and check out these videos on your screen right now!